Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And in this video, I'll show you how to properly install the freeze application in Astro VC and how to resolve one of the error messages that will come up after installing and freezing the system. So let's get started. I've already downloaded Fireonix uh, defreeze application in my computer and extracted it on desktop. So this is the installer. And to show you that Astro is working currently, and I have six workplaces set up here, although they have not been started, but I can start in with one Astro workplaces recently. So moving on to installation of defreeze application, just extract it, double click it, and Continue, next. Exit log remind and click next. Now, if you have license key, paste it here and click next. And since I don't have the license key right now, so I'm going to use the evaluation and then click on next. Now, by default, C drive or system partition or system text or system drive will be frozen. Other drive or data partition or any other partitions will be frozen as well. If you don't want to freeze them, then change the status to thought and they will not be frozen. And also if you plan to add additional hard drive in the future and then check this option, keep newly discovered hard disk drive thought. So I'm going to check it and click on next. Thought space, you can go into more details about this from their manual and their website. I'm not going to go into it and set it up. Click install to install the application. Now, once the application has fully installed, it's going to reboot the computer once. The computer has rebooted after defreeze was installed and now defreeze is in full state. Once the computer starts after installing the defreeze program, it will ask to set a password. To open it, shift double click it and enter the password. And if you forgot to set the password at first glance, then you can set it again from here. It's best to set the password. You don't want others to disable the defreeze program or set it in thought mode. The password is now set. This is the first boot after defreeze application has been installed. So there are no issues running as for application. When you reboot again, you will get an error message, which I'll show you in a minute. Now let me reboot the computer and show you the error message. I have rebooted the computer and reached the desktop. Now let me open the Astro program. And immediately you'll see an error prompt or error dialog as to start program. Error 2 minus 5. This happens after installing the first program. And to resolve this, we have to set a registry value in the computer. Let me show you where to set it. So you have to go to computer execute local machine, system, current control set, services, mute VNX, and create a new D word, ignore, last, boot, and value should be one. You have to set this value with boot pod. Currently it's boot frozen, so I will set it as pod, and then set the value again. Let me okay, and we start it. Let me close. Now, after I restart the computer, the computer will be in thought mode and any changes I made will persist. So let me reboot the computer and get back. The computer has rebooted after thawing the system. And let me apply the register. I'll have the link to download this register patch in the description of this video. So let me show you. As I mentioned earlier, ignore last book with value of 1. Two services with DNF service. Let me apply this. Okay. Let me show you in registry editor. And here's the value. Ignore last word with the value of one. And after this, you need to just freeze the system again and reboot the computer. Let me do that. Frozen. Okay. And after restarting the computer, the computer will be in frozen state. So after freezing the system again, you can see here the freeze is in frozen state. Let me the master control. And there were no errors. I can start the workplaces. As you can see, the workplaces are starting now. 
that's about it for this video if you have any questions then comment in this video and if you like this video then don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel have a good day